The prophet Isaiah said that they that come of Jacob would blossom and bud and fill the face of the world with fruit. The nation of Israel has now become the third largest exporter of fruit in the world. God spoke to the mountains of Israel and said they would be planted again, they would be tilled, the land would be sown, and this land that had become so barren would become fruitful and like the Garden of Eden. God said, I will do it. He did it. You go to Israel today and you see the fields covered with grain, covered with trees, and you realize God has done it. Let's take a look at, a, at another interesting verse. Way back in the Old Testament, Isaiah 27, verse 6, quote, Israel shall blossom and bud and fill the face of the world with fruit, unquote. I mean, this was wilderness until a very few years ago. It was uninhabited and it seemed to be uninhabitable. Go to Israel today. The forests that they've planted have brought in increasing rainfall and Joel 2 verse 23 foretold that. Israel sells flowers to Holland. That's astonishing. I mean exactly what these scriptures foretold is happening in our day. And You go there and Israel is blossoming like a bud. According to Israel's Central Bureau of Statistics, Israel has significantly increased irrigation in the land during our current generation. Even from space, the once desolate nation of Israel is now lush with vegetation. In stark contrast, the surrounding nations are mostly barren.